morning trucking divas and those inspired to be trucking divas hey to my road warriors out there today I'm just taking a ride up to Bakersfield California and I have a question for you guys you'll hear the question later on but I really need your advice and your help if you can't fit your answer in the comment section I want you to email me about what I'm gonna be talking about it's just a life choice decision I've been talking to you guys about going over the road and me and my husband are going back and forth in the conversations about it so send me your comments if you can't fit it down in the comment section on YouTube Drive 49 miles why is she talking Shaniqua anyways um, send me your comments to D E E dot Sova S O V A at yahoo.com because I really need some wisdom here and it's really funny I was thinking yesterday I need to start taking my Bible my little New Testament with me um, when I'm driving I have an app on my iPad called you version so if you're at a truck stop right now and you just need some word you can get that app or go to you version y o u v e r s i o n dot com and it'll give you um, access to the Bible app but anyway after I fueled and went inside to go get my receipt and I came back out these people do this all the time they leave these um, Bibles in truck stops and places where they know drivers are gonna be and so I came outside and um, I was looking at the free you know how they have those stands with the free notifications and free magazines and stuff like that and look guys this was sitting there I was just thinking about bringing my my little New Testament and because I don't always have Wi-Fi access and I forgot it when I left this morning and look at God look at what he did for me he left this particular Bible specifically made it's called uh, the company is called Highway Melodies Incorporated they're out of Grand Rapids Michigan but it was waiting for me people and you know what one of my favorite scriptures is found in uh it was on that page matthew is it matthew 633 because i'm looking for answers right now and here's what it says in matthew 633 this is the new international niv version but it says but I but seek first his kingdom and his righteousness and all these things will be given to you as well this this little tab right here this tab right here was inside of the Bible on the page at Matthew 633 so you know if that's not God giving me a message I'm telling you I don't know what else is but anyway, I do need you guys' help. I want to tell all of you trucking divas and road warriors out there to have a blessed, wonderful, and safe week. And
Take ramp to Highway 99. Ride on Colony Road, then take ramp ahead. <coughs> Shaniqua Navigation keeps on telling me to go to Bakersfield, but she doesn't know I have to fuel, lady. Calm it down, girlfriend. Operator, that's who I want to work for. This place is cracking. Oh, I see an open spot and I'm going to take it. Bakersfield, California. Okay, well since I'm just cruising out here, I just wanted to, you know, have this conversation with you trucking divas and road warriors out there. Because I'm going through a little bit of a transition in my life trying to plan out the next five to ten years and um, I finally got my husband to start thinking about going over the road and um, here's my dilemma my dilemma is I'm looking for the right company and I've been doing a lot of research looking into companies, watching YouTube videos, seeing what other drivers are out there saying. Um, I know that there's options out there for me to become an owner-operator and we can run teams. But before he gets into it, we had the conversation yesterday because I'm really, I'm so there already, but I'm not going to go into this blind side. Before he can give up his position with the company he's been with for the last 21 years, or coming into 21 years, it has to be a solid plan, you know, because he's going to be giving up his retirement, he's going to be giving up medical benefits, and that's really a big concern of his, you 
know when you're a senior in your company, it's a big deal. And I don't want to haphazardly, you know, get him to go in a truck with me and then all of a sudden start having all these issues. But I'm looking for a company, guys. I'm looking for a company that offers training for my husband to be able to upgrade to a Class A driver. And I'm also considering the owner-operator situation. And I just really need you guys' advice and feedback on what's the best company. What, what is your opinion of who's got the best situation for me and my husband to run teams because I don't want him to sacrifice anything for me and then later on down the road regret that decision. It's a big, big step for him to give up, you know, everything that he's worked so hard for in the last 20 years. I want him to experience this life that I love so much.